Hello everybody, it's Ralph Hampel from ev3dev.org. Today I'm going to show you how to add a color LCD to your LEGO Mindstorms EV3 brick. Before we get started, here's a quick preview of what it looks like. The credit for this awesome hack really needs to go to David Lechner, the ev3dev.org co-founder. He's the one that did the hard work of figuring out which signals go where. Stay tuned to the end of the video to find out how you can win a custom LEGO 2x2 tile with the ev3dev.org logo. You'll need to buy about $30 worth of parts to perform this hack. You'll get the FPC stick and the 1.8 inch LCD from Adafruit. DigiKey will get you the FPC socket and the FPC cable. I'm not going to explain how to disassemble the EV3. If you can't figure out how to take the four screws out of the base and the four screws removing the display holder, you're not ready for this hack. I had to remove the SD card holder from the back of the LCD module so that it would fit properly in the case. Next, I had to use a Dremel tool to provide clearance for the parts that were still on the back of the display card. All the magic happens right here in the display socket. We're going to use the FPC cable to connect to the FPC stick. The FPC stick will have individual wires soldered to the LCD display. About two hours after we start, we're all done. Now we can close up the case and have a look at our handiwork. You can see the displays are noticeably different, and when you turn it on, it looks awesome. The first time I booted my modified EB3, I realized I'd made a huge error. I made an assumption about which way was up on the LCD display. Fortunately, a simple change in the EV3 board configuration file turned the display right around. Here's what a typical boot looks like. I've speeded it up and cut out the boring parts in the middle. But you can see it's a full color display and it's way easier to read than the old black and white LCD. I think I'll keep it. To win your own custom EV3Dev.org tile, just leave a comment on this video. I'll choose a winner at random on Friday, June 12, 2015.